boy that sounds like Chief Barnabas to both boys. <laughs> I love that. That's good, that's good. Inspector, what is happening? What is happening? Your boys ransacking every nook and crannies of this country. I mean, yes, confiscating everything and unleashing mayhem to my boys. I can't understand this. Take drugs, my foot! Inspector, substandard drug, my foot! Inspector, you know this, you know the game. Man must work now. That is it! Alright. Now, 50 million. It's alright. I, I, I come up, I come up to 100 million. 100 million naira. Inspector, let's sell it. Let's sell it with 150 million. No problem. Let's put it. So you can let's sell it with 200. No problem. 200 million. Yeah, no problem. Tomorrow, check your account. You know, you know how we do it. All right, all right. I want this mess to stop. It's okay. My Apple Inspector. <laughs> Oh, that's good, that's good. And what of your wife? Oh, Ted and my oh. The, the last time I came, they did. Oh, I, I love this. I love Congratulations, Olga. Okay. Okay. Congratulations. Okay. And you know one thing? You are the first people who are knowing about it today. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe say money don't fool a pocket dog. Okay, thank you. Okay. So, what have you guys been doing before you started begging? Olga? Okay. I was a big player, sir. I did push better, sir. The guy does it, I see. You know what? All your sufferings has ended today. Yeah. <laughs> you will yes, never beg you. in your life again. Yeah, thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Yeah, thank you. Get up, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. Give me one minute. Yes, my bad. Yeah. Didn't I say don't be down? Don't be down. Hold on. Get up, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. Get up. That's all for us, okay? It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. I'll have to take your pictures for record papers. Uh. <laughs> That's good. And I'll be so glad to be with you guys tomorrow as big boys. Thank you, okay? I will not hesitate to shoot any of you if I still see you as beggars two years from now. Good luck, gentlemen. Remember me in your prayers, and I will remember you in my own prayers. <laughs> okay, no problem. Yeah, no problem. Okay. 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 Take care of yourself. All right, take care. <laughs>
Happy birthday to me. Happy birthday to me. Happy birthday, happy birthday. Happy birthday to me. <laughs> yeah, I'm plus one today. I'm plus one today. I am plus one today. I'm plus one today. Hip 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 hooray! Has it done to you this time? Sandra, I'm talking to you! Ha! Huh, Mitch! What did you do to her? Look, Mitch, you are trying me in this house! You are trying me! Don't ever push me to the wall because if you, I will make sure you regret having me as a mother! Why can't I rest for you? Are you going back? Mitch here, Mitch there, all the time! Don't worry, just leave him. Just leave him! But believe it or not, women are men, but wives are few. It's less boy. Hello? Are you threatening me? For your information, I've lost count of number of calls like this. Your drugs are counterfeit and must be destroyed. Have a nice day.
our honorable DG is sounding harsh. <laughs> what I mean, very, very harsh. But she's she's playing hard to get. <laughs> I know. That is the usual thing. In the beginning, it's always like this tough. <laughs> Until she finds out that the system can change. And then she would begin to play ball. <laughs> I wanted to call the presidency and find out the fellow DGs she dined with at the ministers mm -hmm. while I'm moving to the ministry. Okay. You understand? Mm -hmm. It will help us a whole lot. Mm -hmm. You know, establishing contact and entering our name into ah, good books. Mm -hmm. It will help us so much. Okay. If she says so, <laughs> but I'm, I'm just knowing that one day we are going to toast <laughs> to a dynamic strong, benevolent fighter <laughs> who does not know that this system cannot change. She would break and she would find out. <laughs> I love that. Good afternoon, madam. Please sit. How may I help you? <laughs> um, I was sent by this country's uh, National Association of Drug Importers. You know, it's actually under the supervision of your ministry. And they have asked me to, oh, excuse me, present to you. Uh, this check of 500 million naira. <laughs> Go back and tell them that my salary is okay for me. Huh? Tell them that I love their lives. The lives of their, of their mothers, fathers, Sisters, brothers, uncles, aunts, and children. Have a nice day. Madam. You can excuse me, please. Solution as far as I'm going to sit down. I say, Sit down, sit down, sit down. Why ah, are you looking like this? You know, that woman turned me down. She turned down the check and walked me out of her office with a good deal. She did. Look at the check. She did. That's good. <laughs> That's good. She will realize very soon that she has made a mistake of her life. For rejecting my offer, she will realize that she has made a tremendous mistake. Comrade, the earlier you do something, the better. Because that woman, she's something else. Stop saying that! Something else! What 
is she? She's a nobody. She's a fool. She's an opportunist. She is a nobody. I am telling you. Nobody plays with the lion. Let me tell you. I will squeeze life out of her. I will skin her alive. I promise you that. I will give her another system she cannot decode. Just mere opportunist. That's what she is. I trust you. That's what she is. She's a nobody. You really know this country proud. <laughs> so I want to encourage you to stop at nothing at doing your job. Huh? I was telling somebody the other day that the joy I know way back in school will stop at nothing to bring those evil men who engage themselves in the nefarious acts to book. <laughs> so it was not surprising the other day when I saw you in the news they were showing how you confiscated fake drugs and substandard products and even burnt them against all odds. We are really proud of you. Thank you so much. And I promise not to fail the citizens of this country. I will never. You're welcome, Joe. You're welcome. Uh, um, where is Mitch? He went to Abuja to do some paperwork for me. Yes. Well done. Hey. <sighs> Thank you so much.
Barabas, il dit que je suis un homme. Je suis un homme. Je suis un homme. Je suis We are strategizing. Tomorrow afternoon, we are going to go to the Almost 20 million naira. Can I wear a to pay in a I was going to go 20 million naira. Naira, Brabas, do not this woman to a little bit of a robber. Come on, the best of you. she um okay uh, i'll be there first thing in the morning all right sorry Who is that? Oh. Hi. Sandra. Good day. Do you have an appointment? <laughs> yes, good day. Oh. Yeah. I'm glad to see Mitch. Woman. Uh, yeah. Sandra is here to see you. Huh? Okay. He's expecting you. Come in. Let's go and see her. I can't. She has security around that. They wouldn't let me see her. Anyways, I, I don't think the injuries are serious. Oh, thank God. I was really scared. So how are you feeling? 
first. <laughs> Come here. <laughs> so cute. She's lucky. She did not sustain any serious injury. And her blood pressure is normal. The scan and the zebra test to run put all doubt to rest. In fact, I want her to rest. Thank God. Thank you very much, Doctor. You're welcome. A young lady. Agent Otu, the flight ticket of the hotel will be on your desk in the next five minutes. You know what to do. Good. Good. I must apologize for the impromptu arrangement. It's due to the nature of the job we have at hand. You guys have just two weeks to make a concise study of the nook and corners of this town, after which we all assemble to break down the mission. I'm optimistic Agent A has made every arrangement to see that you girls don't envisage any financial difficulties. Oh, yes, of course. She has. Good. I'll see you guys. In a fortnight. Once again, you're welcome. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. is going to be very tough. 
when I lost my team. The chief security officer to the president was telling me earlier today of how the national security advisor was almost killed by Mr. Jack Stoggs. Agent Neka, do you have any question? No, sir. Thank you. Anyone else? No. Silence forever. That is all we need. Yes, now I want to tell you something. Nobody, which you know, no man, nobody, born of a woman, steps on my feet or Panama's woman's feet and gets away with it. It's not possible. She must be silenced. I say, no matter what's, what's going to cost. Thank you very much. Thank you. I love what I'm hearing. It's all right. Shh. I got the package. You're delaying. Do you have any problem? No. Now listen, I will increase your pay by 10% if you deliver. If you deliver. Consider it done. Okay, all right. I'm waiting, I'm waiting. Okay. Take this girl, she the boss of my mind. That's the 
girl, she won't turn on the light, yeah. She won't turn on the light, yeah. On the low, shake that thing on the low. Now you they drive me crazy. I'm back on gone crazy. Check out the water bomb bomb. See this girl, she a little dumb dumb. Why he am biting down the shop up?
No, I should have. Just relax. Okay. Relax, man. Just say sure. Relax, man. <laughs> What is it? Send me your account number immediately. What? I'm sending back your money. What? Tell me what you're supposed to pay me. No. You heard me. Comrades. Comrade Oshon, are you sure of what you're saying? Okay, let me let me look. Okay. We had copies of popular brands of almost all the products. We had expired products or products that we are labeled and those that we are about to expire. You see? When these products were about to expire in the foreign countries, they were shifted to the countries that have no regulations. And that was why we put up regulation in 2002 to enable us to inspect facilities abroad. And part of it was that we wanted to see the unlimited orchards and plantations where these fruits were planted. But you see, those people that submitted their goods to us Disappeared and abandoned them. Hey! Look at this, look at this opportunity! Exposing everybody. You will not go free, you will never go free! Look at this idiot! No challenge fool! Drug counterfeiting is one of the most greatest atrocities of our time. It is mass murder, apart from being an economic sabotage. You see? What pains me most is that it affects the most valuable people, the poor. Those people are the people that don't live in good environments. And sometimes when they become sick, they will go and buy drugs and buy poison. We encountered a lot of challenges in the process of these fights. The chief among the challenges were corruption and conflict of interest. You see, some of them tried to compromise us, but when they failed, they resorted to all kinds of intimidation, harassment, Idiot. blackness, and stress of all sorts. Male opportunities you are. You are nobody! 
you will, you will, you will see more fire. You see fire. God, what kind of woman is this? What kind of idiot is this? She rejected my offer. All I did, she refused. She will see another star. Lovely. How's your family? Oh, that's lovely. Glory be to God. <laughs> I'm okay, I'm okay, I'm okay. Yeah. No problem. Um, Auntie, uh, please, uh, I really need a house help. Yes, I want you to help me find a good one, please. Oh, that's lovely, that's lovely. Thank you so much. Oh, no problem, no problem. I will see you. Yes, I will see you later. Yes. Oh, God bless you too. Bye-bye. <laughs> I love you too. <laughs> hey. Comrades, the situation is metamorphosing from bad to worse. What do we do? Chief, the leadership is heading for the rocks. If we don't do anything. I have spoken to the agent of a high profile killer. But this agent is asking for 5 billion naira. 5 billion naira? 5 billion naira. That includes taking care of whom? Everything. Then, go ahead with the deal. It's a good deal. What? It's worth it. Go ahead with the deal. Chief. I say it's worth it. Okay. The man who killed last night was an undercover agent who failed to obey instructions. He was ordered to execute Chief Mrs. Joy Chibuzo. Of the National Drug Agency? Yes. I was asked to do my job. And when I asked why, leaked from the presidency and National Security Headquarters told me she is a spy. She has been trading government top secret to foreign superpowers. It was on that note I got convinced. And I want every one of you to see that way. But I... I didn't make it. But it's a doubt. And that rules you out of the operation. Agent Morin, you will lead the operation. Certainly. Agent Joker, you will assist her. And I am Agent Judith who will take care of the logistics. Have I made myself clear? Very clear, sir. I wouldn't mind a stick of something. Sure.
The evil of fake drugs cannot even be compared with the combined scourge of malaria, HIV, AIDS, and armed robbery put together. Because malaria can be treated or prevented, HIV, AIDS can be avoided or even managed when infected, but drugs kill immense. We had beer and other alcoholic beverages without best before date. Worst still, they had nitrosamine. Nitrosamine is a castrogenic and it is natural byproduct of brewing. Our investigation reveals that breweries refines properly for exports, but when it is for internal consumption, it was anything. We had people using bromide as bread enhancer and they knew that bromide causes cancer, kidney failure, loss of hearing, break of vitamins and all. The most air raising of all the wholesome foods we discovered in circulation was the man that was mixing milk. Cassava flour and sugar as infant formula and he has done this for many years before he was caught. People were importing cosmetic creams containing hydroquinone and mercury, bleaching creams from all over the world and those countries that they are bringing them from don't use them because they know that they destroy the skin and technically affect the kidney. at the restaurant. Are you ready? I'm not hungry. <laughs> you're not hungry? Mm -hmm. Tell me you're joking. Okay, anyway, I'm going to go have my breakfast. I'll see you later. Okay. Okay. Need to ask. You must really do this job. I mean, do we have to? I have to, as in, do we really have to? See, 
know this woman is innocent. But five billion naira is not a chicken change. It's not a small money. See, I love you so much. And I want to spend the rest of my life with you. But not as a dealer. See, let's just do this deal. Then do one more. Not for anything, just do it for us and our unborn children. Not that we still have our kids. No news. No news. We searched every nook and cranny in this town. She's nowhere to be found. Her phone is still switched off. Okay. okay, you know what? Pack up your things, we're leaving here, okay? If she wants us, she will contact us. Isn't your fault. Let's just thank God that you are alive and you're not seriously injured. You will be okay. okay. I have no hope. I don't relax. I understand you. Since you have no better place to go if you are discharged, I will take you home and make sure you recover fully. After which you will go back to school. Okay? Thank you so much, Ma. That is if you are well behaved. I will not disappoint you. You need some rest, okay?
relax. Okay? This is big time now. I'm the heir of this whole empire. You roll with me? Trust me, you'll be dining with the kings. I'll pretend that this conversation never took place. Mitch, please see me as a sister. She is our new house hub. Her name is Grace. Grace, Mitch. Hi, it's nice to meet you. Pleasure is mine. Neka! Yes, ma. Come. Yeah, thank you. I'll meet our new house hub. Her name is Grace. Grace, Neka. Oh, welcome. Nice to meet you. Can you take her to the room close to yours? She will be using the hands for her room. Oh, no, there's no need for that, ma. Why? She and I can share mine. It's too big for me. But some people like their privacy. Actually, ma'am, I'm not one of those people. I would gladly share with her. It's oh. all right. OK, follow me. Let me help you carry Oh, I'll have that. Thank you, ma. <sighs> so, son, how was your day? Oh, um, laid back. I'm trying to send an email to my friend. Okay, that's... How did you find your way into this household and what are you doing here? Don't tell me you don't know what I'm doing here. <sighs> Nika, if what I am thinking is what you are thinking, then, my dear friend, you are in for a whole lot of trouble. I will not fail to eliminate you, crush you, or get rid of you if you get into my way while accomplishing this mission. Mr. Leo is not whom he claims he is. He is a contract killer, and he's using us to accomplish his selfish desires. After a long journey, I deserve to rest. Don't get in my way. Let me also remind you, either for us or against us. I vowed never to kill again. But if anybody makes an attempt on Joy's life, that person will have to kill me first. Nika, don't play with me. I weep for you because you should know me by now. I am sexy, arrogant, and above all, I am so strong and I will not feel to so crush you if you ever come across my way. Don't dare me. Don't. Fetch you out. 
Worry, darling. I'm only testing their wits. Neka, when I'm ready to strike, trust me, you won't know. May God help us. Oh, you help you. <laughs> We do to you if he finds out that you like her that much. Grace, there. Just no. Ma, please come. What are you doing? I actually just finished washing your clothes. I'm about to prepare your room. Could you please fry some plantains for me? I'll do that, ma. I'll do it. Really? Yes. Then you go and make the sauce. Oh, mom, we've shared the house chores. She takes care of the cleaning and I'm in charge of the kitchen. The work will be too much for her. Yeah, and besides, besides, I'm almost done with this, so... Yeah. Can go? Of course, ma. You're so kind. Nice girl. Okay. God will bless you. Okay. I hope you like it now. Very nice. I love it.
happy Ben. I actually wanted to come tell you that dinner, oh, I mean breakfast is ready. Served. I know the routine here, okay? And believe me, I don't like people like you. I think it's better we avoid each other. Capish? Noted. Just pretend I didn't see anything. But if this happens again, I will sing. Do you get that? Ben. Why, hello, handsome. Yeah, baby. You started me. What's up? You do look hot. Thank you. Tell me, why are you avoiding me? I'm not avoiding you. You on the other hand, you're the one avoiding me. Oh, come on, my love. Even you know that's impossible. Besides, you know the way things are out here. Pinky cheap and that stupid bear. But, I'm home alone. So, let's see what you've got. Are you sure you can handle this bad boy? Why don't you try this good girl? <laughs> huh? Mm. Oh, don't be silly. Don't you do that. Don't you do that. What's going on here? Well, it's called voice coding and called diabat. What do you want from me? <laughs> what do you want? Huh? Well, our boss wanna see you. Not so fast, darling.
Why don't you want to allow me to do my job? I picked from Gotas. I paid at you. I made you whatever you are today. And you want to disturb my job, right? Listen, if you do not turn yourself in, I will do that for you. Shut up. And let me warn you, if I Shut ever... Up. Okay! Okay, good evening, sir. Okay, good evening. No, okay, good evening. Okay, I'm fine. Okay, do you still remember me? Yeah, the Vegas, right? Ah! Yes, okay. Okay, you get better breed, dude. What are you doing? Um, okay, my cousin there. Okay. Yeah. So, I won't go buy something for her. So, what do, what do you do now? Okay, I'm an importer. I import goods from Kotonu, Dubai, China, okay? Even Japan, oh. That's good, that's good. I can see as I did now. I don't find where we're now. I can see me now. It's okay, it's okay. Thanks to God. I got thank you. I got thank you so much. God go bless you, okay? God bless you. Okay, bye bye. All right then. All right then. All right. I got wife. Bye bye. You. I'll let me warn you. If you cross my path, trust me, I'm gonna crush you. Do you get that now? Hi, baby. Let's get out. Hello? Hello? Hello, Morgan. What's happening? What's going on? <sighs> Can you imagine that brat sending one silly message that I should hand myself over to the police? Or she would do it for me. What? Morgan, I can trust you. I can count on you. See what you're going to do for me now. Make sure you put that idiot to sleep upon wrapping that cake, okay? Thank you very much. Trust you.
Thank you so much, my queen. No, I will never. Amen. Please take good care of yourself. I will you keep in touch. Bye. You were close to me. Hello, what can I do for you? Okay. Meet me at 7 o'clock tomorrow morning in my office. Bye. My dear friend, I have good news for you. I think by midday today, Joy, her son, and her two bodyguards will be dead. What? That's again not dead already. What have you done? What have you done? Nothing. I only played with the brakes a little. I felt like without brakes, the car will move faster. Don't you think? Oh my God. I'm trying to waste your time, my dear friend. Your phone has been taken care of. You cannot make or receive calls for the next 24 hours. What's all this now? Don't kill me. It's you and I in this house, remember? When you get me a bit pissed and I blow your head off. I cannot wait to blow your head off. You know why? That is because I hate you so much. Hello, darling. Yeah, hello. Oh, yes, my love. I'm waiting for the news of her demise before her day. Our dear friend here will make her to sleep. Alright. I'm counting on you. <laughs> of course, you. I love you too. Bye. When I'm ready to strike, you will not see me. What was your reply? Ah, oh. God help us. Who needs help now? <laughs> What is happening? What is happening? My phone doesn't tell me she's on her way home now. As I'm talking to you, next 10 minutes she'll be home. What? No death? No accident? What's happening? Don't you take this Don't you? Don't you? That can't be. I got the brakes. What? 
Why are you laughing? Word, who you are. Nobody will believe me. But not anymore. Because this pistol will implicate you. Ta da! <laughs> you want to kiss me too? Well, the pistol is gone. Just like a flash. Ta da! <laughs> Who's laughing last night? What did you do? <sighs> about last night? Yes, about last night. You came in and do stuff. You will be okay, oh? I never ever knew that a drug that is meant to save life could also be so deadly. Only if it's substandard or fake. <sighs> Don't ever make such mistake. Eh? Always insist on drugs with National Drug Agency's registration number. You are very lucky. Thousands of lives have been lost because they bought fake drugs. Huh? Just thank your God. 
<sighs> that is why I've been fighting and will always fight until those evil men are brought to book. Yes, I'll make sure. Stop crying, okay? Thank you for saving my life. Thank you. Mr. Barnabas Ubo. Mr. Barnabas Ubo. You have the right to remain standing. terrible person. What if I had died? What would become of me? Joy is a good woman. She knows what she's doing and she's right. I hate myself for not listening to you when you warned me about Leo. How could I? How could I listen? We're engaged. He's my fiance. What do I do? Just, what do I do? Just follow your heart and do what is right, okay? Remember us? Oh. The beggars I gave money on my birthday, right? I have a sound memory. Take your money. We don't need such money. We don't eat blood money. <laughs> What's the meaning of this? We are the real Federal Investigation and Intelligence Bureau officers, which you are impersonating. I still don't understand. That's why we had to follow you up to this moment to nail you. We know all your operations, but we don't have tangible evidence to nail you. No, Mr. But as they say, every day is for the thief, but one day is for the owner of the house. Uh, Mr. Federal, whatever you call yourself, like you say, you don't have any tangible evidence to nail me, so you don't have a point. Can't you see? Unfortunately for you, 
I've already told them everything they need to know. I even took them to our hideout and they've ransacked the whole place, meaning that they have enough evidence to prosecute you. Did I forget to mention for life? With your lives! Mr. Liu Ibezemako, you are under arrest for murder and conspiracy to commit murder. You have the right to remain silent because anything you say or do will be used against you in the law court. Arrest him. It's not like I am trying to judge you. But remember we are strangers in this place And whatever we have done is written more than clear Somewhere we are mm -hmm. And the seasons cannot change it And the rain cannot erase the traces of your past And no matter who you are Whatever you have done You'll surely come before You can run But you can hide Oh, no matter who you trying to screw you But remember there is nothing left to take Cause all is vanity upon vanity So what we fighting for 